since we know penis envy is a very real thing. It's real. Let's say your all your wishes were granted and you got one for a day. What would you do with it? Do we get balls with it? There is a song about what I would do if I had a penis for a day. Is it helicopter dick? I for sure measure it. 100%. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And then Google, what's normal? Average size. <laughs> or I would call like a hotline and be like, yeah, um, I'm going for a friend. What's a normal penis size? <laughs> I'm holding balls all day long. I'm holding balls all, all day, day long. All, all day long. Ball all day long. balls. How do you guys walk around with this thing between your legs? How do you run? Legs? How do you run? I would run. <laughs> you just run. Well, just run, <laughs> see how it bounces. There's a lot of times that you, you guys have never had to deal with it where you just get a surprise boner and you're like in Target, yeah. and you're like looking at cookware, and you're just like, huh. We're like, do really? I really All like right. this cookware? Is morning wood real? Every day? Yeah. Every day? Yeah. Like, you, okay, I, I would also look forward to that. I would want to know what it feels like to like tuck it in your waistband. Like, what, how does that feel? Like, what does that feel like? <laughs> oh no. You know what I mean? Yes. Is it sensitive to different like, to like different textures? <laughs> I would have so much sex. You'd have oh. sex? Do you realize Wait, how first. hard it is to have sex when you have a penis? You don't get to decide anymore when you yeah. have a penis. Oh. Someone else has to say, okay, yes, you can have sex with me. When you have a dick, they call the shots. I would put it in just about anything that I would be able to fit it in. <laughs> just like American Pie st style and like put it in foods. Feel what it feels like to like in between like sheets, just put it on stuff. Just take just like lay it stuff. on things. My dick on my pillow. My <laughs> dick on like this. in a sandwich. My dick on a cheese plate. So you would just stick it anywhere, as in as many things as possible. As many glory holes. Glory Not holes. As I don't know if I've ever seen a glory hole in the wild. I don't know if they exist. I feel like there's a glory hole in most men's restrooms. I, I thought it was like the secret society of glory holes. It like is. everyone does it, but nobody talks about it. Yeah. My I, my mind doesn't just go to sex. It goes to just going to bars and like hitting on girls. I feel like if you had a girl's brain, then yeah. you could pull a girl real quick. Can I, can I have a male body with my much better brain? You cannot have a penis and a girl's brain. That's, yeah, just that's, not, yeah. that's just not. That's just not. It just, it just like rolls it out. Half of your brain gets sucked into your dick. Dang it! You know, it's a little bit annoying having something that you have to be conscious of all the time. Oh, like your boobs? Yeah, I was gonna say we oh, have something to, like in front of us. We like carry Every this day. Thing. natural. I'd like to experience what it's like for uh, to helicopter since guys yeah. are such a fan of that. Oh my okay. god! Right? Okay. Right. Or two. The first thing I do is that thing that guys do where they like swing it against their legs. Oh no! The, like the windmill. Yeah, they like, like slap it against their legs. Like forgetting Terry Marshall. Oh. I got a surprise for you. I think I would teabag something. I don't know about other guys. I mean, I don't oftentimes get to teabag women, but I mean, that'd be kind of cool. Twist what, the dick sled, head. you know, the basketball see, shorts? Walking around my house all day, slapping my I dick against my I would want to see what gives me a boner. Like, I would want to find oh, out, like. I could go into like an ice cream shop and like, whoop, yeah. like. You're in Whole Foods. Boner. <laughs> I go into a shoe shop. Boner. Maybe you could just like make yourself have a boner in public so you'd feel that awkwardness, you know, so that next time you saw somebody who accidentally had a boner, you'd be like, does that happen often? I, I mean, I don't know. I have said the words before. Don't let my boner fool you. I'm actually very sad right now.